Hey there, it's Kylie Menz here and hope you're well. I'm just shooting this quick video for um, Princess Fears for how to become a mediapreneur. Now this is week nine testimonial and I have to say I've had some massive shifts this week. Um, we originally started the week setting out looking at um, how to get sponsorships for our shows. So um, it was great because it gave me strong clarity around talking about what my show is all about, what the mission is for the show, what the benefits are to potential sponsors sponsors, really honing down my target market and letting people know all about that. But actually my shift come through in um, an exercise I was given specifically to create a whole new product in 48 hours. Um, and it had to come from this exercise that we've been doing, how to, how to become a mediapreneur. Um, and I was really surprised. Um, it was about how much belief I have in the knowledge that I have. Um, you know, I've been online marketing now for about two years. I obviously come from a highly successful sales background. Um, but I was lacking in that belief in myself that I had something to say. Um, and by creating a product within 48 hours, you know, I just realized how much knowledge I had and how much I need to be able to share that with other people to help them move forward in their business. Um, and, you know, I went on to sell, um, you know, about 10 in literally less than a couple of hours of the initial product I created. Um, but the, the biggest breakthrough that I had was actually belief in a real mentor. Now, when you start your journey online, sometimes you can be taken for a bit of a fool, I think. Um, and, you know, a lot of people promise stuff, they don't deliver. Um, and I realized I had a big trust issue um, with what um, Fizz was saying. And it was really interesting. So I was battling with my own inner ego. Um, and and it was because I've been let down so often before. You know, I've spent a lot of money on some mentors that have not delivered. Um, and I guess I was understanding what Fizz was talking about and um, her support, but I wasn't necessarily believing it internally. Um, and by doing this exercise, I've had a massive breakthrough this week. Um, you know, and I've just stopped. My ego's out of the way. I'm listening. I'm following every step that she's taken because I've now got that belief in the success that I've got something to say um, and that I know my show is going to be a success. So even though we did lots of practical things this week, my big shift was in mindset. And I know that's now going to just carry me forward. I know that now I've got something to say. I know I can help other women entrepreneurs work less and earn more, um, you know, using the internet to leverage their business. I've got that skill set. I've been creating an income online now for the last year um, and I want to help others. And, you know, I'm so strategic in the way that I think. I look logically. I look outside the box um, and I know I can pull my business skills in to actually help other women as well. Um, you know, I ran a highly successful sales office for five years and I guess I'd kind of forgotten that I had that skill set. Um, you know, running a sales sales office, you know, managing staff, doing a high turnover. It takes a lot of skills to do that. And I'd forgotten I had those skills and that I wasn't pulling that in into my online business. So Fizz gave me back belief in myself. Um, and I know stuff's really changed this week. Um, I'm looking at launching the second phase of that product in the next couple of weeks. And I know I'm going to go out speaking about it. I'm that confident in what I've created. It's just an awesome topic area. So not only have I learned the, the, the factual stuff behind getting sponsored, and I've been building my LinkedIn profile, getting back around that again, um, building my own group and things like that. But actually, I had a real massive mindset breakthrough. So, you know, trust in your mentor. Let them show you what they've been through and how they can help you move forward. So um, thanks, Fizz. It's been a fantastic time so far. And I know week 10 is just going to blow us all away again. So it's Kylie Menz here and how to become a mediapreneur. Cheers.